Man, Bioware creepy music has very similar themes to each other. Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of Dragon Age Origins. Alrighty, when we left off, we had just barely survived our way into the uh, Castle Redcliffe fight with uh, <laughs> our little crew. And turns out, um, there was a comment... A comment, rather, if I can talk right, that uh, pointed out something that I kind of thought made sense, but uh, at the time there was not much I could do all about it. But it they it was very helpful, and I do appreciate it. Uh, number one was that I can set the tactics for everyone in regards to uh, if I hit the right button to what their uh, behavior should be. I set Tomas for aggressive, set Alistair for defensive, for a tank setup. Um, yeah, that, that was about what sounded right. And then for Morrigan, ranged, and for Liliana, ranged, because they'll be my ranged people. Uh, that was in the suggestion, and I followed through on that because I could, and I very much appreciate it. Uh, the one thing I couldn't do was with uh, Morrigan in regards to spells. Uh, they suggested fire would be better for zombies, which I obviously thought was a good idea. Um, because, you know, fire against undead usually works pretty well. Uh, unfortunately, as you can see, it's not available with Morrigan. We haven't gotten to that level yet. Uh, we only just started out, so we don't actually have that ability unlocked yet. Uh, I spent more time going into healing and whatnot. I should have devoted some to fire. That is my bad. But uh, hopefully, hopefully this will, you know, help out in the future. Um, maybe if I set her tactics to, huh, what can I set them to? Maybe I should set it for a higher threshold, like 75, because I'm noticing we're dying long before... We can at least do anything. Um, I'm noticing also that I don't have a lot of tactic slots for Morrigan either. It's not great. Um, use ability. What would rejuve? I, I forget. Is rejuvenate stronger? <laughs> Should check on that actually. Um, short term boost to mana or stamina regeneration. Um, the healing, yeah, the heal the rejuvenate only does stamina or mana. Uh, healing does everything else. Um, mass rejuvenation and mass regeneration, huh? Hmm. Huh. Alrighty, I'm already regretting moving her uh, stat here to rejuvenate, but it doesn't even help. Uh, I feel like I should have probably put it into flame blast. Unfortunately, since hindsight's 2020, we just have to live with my decision. Joy. So, yeah. There's that. Um, we'll continue on. And, um, what the fuck is Ben Tegan doing? Okay, 
Okay, the music got creepy. So these are our visitors. As the did the child. Told me about mother. Y yes, Connor. And this is the one who defeated my soldiers. You called them the soldiers? Sent to reclaim my village. Yes. And now it's staring at me. What is it, mother? I can't see it well enough. This. Do you need glasses? I'm kind of standing in front of you. The man, Connor. Like your father. Oh, I am tired of hearing about him. Besides, he's nothing at all like father. Look at him. Breathing and not dying in the slightest. Um, I could change that, mind you. Um, Connor, I beg you. Don't hurt anyone. Ma Mother? What's happening? Kids regain control a little bit. Oh, thank the maker. That won't last long, will Connor. it? Connor, can you hear me? Get away from me, fool woman. You are beginning to bore me. Yep, Grey that Warden. did not last very long. Please don't hurt my son. He is not responsible for what he does. Well, clearly, but you've been protecting him this entire time. Connor didn't mean to do this. It was that mage, the one who poisoned Demon. He started all this. He summoned this demon. Why would he then was just blame him to help for it his later? Father. And made a deal with the demon to do so? Foolish child. It was a fair deal. Are you sure about father that? Is alive. Just as I wanted. Okay. And now it's my turn to sit on the throne and send out armies to conquer the world. Nobody tells me what to do anymore. Right. Nobody tells him what to do. Nobody. Ha 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 ha. Quiet, Uncle. I warned you what would happen if you kept shouting, didn't I? Yes, I did. But let's um, keep things civil. Civil. This man will have the audience he seeks. Tell us, what have you come here for? I came here to help, if I could. To Anything. help me. To help father. To help yourself. Which? To help you. Because, I mean, you, you kind of are in a lot of trouble here right now. I don't need help. I can do everything all by myself. Isn't that right, Mother? That I sounds like someone who can't do I everything all by themselves. Think. and Of course you don't. Very Ever since stubborn. Ever sent the knights away, you do nothing but deprive me of my fun. Frankly, it's getting dull. I crave excitement and action. This man spoiled uh -huh. my sport by saving that stupid village, and now he'll repay me. Will I? Something is coming. Yeah! Yeah! Something is coming. Bad stuff. Okay, well. It's not going well. This is not going well for Alistair. He is getting... Hummeled over there. Enough. And he's dead. So much for uh, saving his ass. We have no choice but to fight. Yeah, how we get our I tried. Make a I tried. And if a light is caught. Uh you must just gonna keep drinking that until we deal with this. Ow! There's archers. No wonder he couldn't fucking defend himself. Okay, this explains a lot. Alright, all right. All right, let's deal with this guy. Okay. Yeah, if, if only you would do it now. There we go. Tegan. Oh, Tegan. Are you alright? Did I not kill him? Better now. I think. Good. My mind is my own again. Good to hear. I'm sorry I had to beat you up. I would never have forgiven myself had you died. Not after I brought you here. The fool I am. Please. Connor's not responsible for this. There must be some way we can save him. You knew about this all along. I... Yes. I didn't tell you because I believed we could help him. I still do. 
Uh -huh. I'm sorry, my lady, but Connor has become an abomination. He's no longer your son. You! You did this to Connor! I didn't. I didn't summon any demon. I told you. Please, if you'll let me help. Help? You betrayed me! I brought you here to help my son, and in return you poisoned my husband? This is the mage you spoke of? Didn't you say he was in the dungeon? He was. I assumed the creatures had killed him by now. He must have been set free. Yeah. He's no more to blame than you are. How dare you! If this man hadn't poisoned my husband, none of this would have happened. He should be executed. Your it secrecy wouldn't have... made his actions possible, Isolde. Yeah. But I... I know what you must think of me, my lady. I took advantage of your fear. I'm sorry. I never knew it would come to this. Well, I shan't turn away his help. Not yet. And if Connor is truly an abomination... He's not always the demon you saw. Connor is still inside him, and sometimes he breaks through. Please, I just want to protect him. To be Isn't fair, it's all, it's all You hired the mage to teach Connor in secret, to protect him. If they discovered Connor had magic, then they'd take him away. I thought if he learned just enough to hide it, then... So, Joan, what can you add to this? The demon in Connor needs to be destroyed. Killing Connor is the easiest way to do that, certainly. But there is another way. A mage could confront the demon in the Fade without hurting Connor himself. What do you mean? Is the demon not within Connor? Not physically. The demon approached Connor in the Fade while he dreamt and controls him from there. We can use the connection between them to find the demon. You can enter the Fade, then? And kill the demon w without hurting my boy? No, but I can enable another mage to do so. It normally requires lyrium and, and several mages. But I have... blood magic. What difference does that make? Lyrium provides the power for the ritual, but I can take that power from someone's life energy. This ritual requires a lot of it, however. All of it, in fact. I so, see. Someone must die? Someone must be sacrificed? Yes, and then we send another mage into the Fade. I can't enter because I'm doing the ritual. Maybe I shouldn't have said anything. It's not much of an option. Someone's going to die either way. Indeed. Either my son, or the sacrifice. Let it be me, then. I will give my life for his. Um. What? Isolde, are you mad? Eamon would never allow this. Either someone kills my son to destroy that thing inside him, or I give my life so my son can live. To me, the answer is clear. Blood Understand. magic. How can more evil be of any help here? Two wrongs don't make a right. It does seem like a sensible choice, with a willing participant. Connor is blameless in this. He should not have to pay the price. It... Uh, it's up to you, my friend. You know more about such things than I do, and it's your companion going into the Fade. The decision is yours. Hmm. There has to be another way. You can find Lyrium and more mages at the Circle of Magi, if they would even do it. That would take too much time. Then there's not much more to say. Something else will need to be done. Are you sure you're ready to die for this? If there is even a chance to save Connor, I am. You rest your hopes on this young mage. He poisoned Eamon, and he could take your life power and attack for all we know. He would be a fool to try. No, I am willing to take his word. I would give my life for the chance to undo what I have done. I still do not agree, but it cannot be my choice. Fuck. At 
this point, it doesn't sound like there's a lot of options. Either he dies or someone else dies. She's willing. This is a fucked up decision. Then I know what we must do. My son awaits your decision. Make it quickly. We let Joan cast the ritual. Thank you. If this will save my son, then I am not afraid. Then who will go into the Fade? One of your companions? Morrigan can do it. I notice you do not ask me first. No matter, I will go as I am your willing slave. Could you not? You have my eternal gratitude. May the maker You're the with only you. one here skilled Certainly enough. Certainly hope not. That would be rather distracting. Yeah, well. Let's, let's get this started. got dark okay all right well Morgan and Liliana disapprove but you know what I didn't have a lot of options What? Is there anyone out there? Hello? Blessed art thou who exists in the sight of the Maker. What in the fuck? Father! Where are you? Oh. Curse this blasted darkness! Why can I see nothing? Are Lehman's in here? You there? Have you seen my son? I can, I can hear him, but I cannot find him. This blasted fog has me turning in circles. This is the Fade. Your kind cannot navigate it any more than you could navigate a dream. I don't understand. Where is my Connor? I will find him for you since I foolishly gave my word that I would. Leave me to it. No. No, you're trying to lead me astray. I do not believe you. Connor! Connor, where are you? Hmm, well, there's no getting through to him now. Connor? Okay. So only find the demon. There's Connor. Who are you? Are you the one that made father ill? Tell me now. Shoo! Run along and play. Or whatever. No! You're here to hurt father! Well... I know it! I won't let you! Okay! Hi there, Miss Demon Lady! Okay, you are... borderline naked. Okay, well, this is this is going somewhere. I'm actually, getting some damage done. Does that count? Did I beat her? Does that count as a win? That. Doesn't seem like a no. Um. You! 
You're the one making father sick. No. I'll help him. You can't stop me. Get out of here. You have to get out. Okay. Am I dreaming? I don't understand any of There's Connor again. Why do you keep hurting me? Why are you trying to stop me? Enough of these games. Give me what I want. Trespasser! I will drive you out! Right. Good luck with that. Oh, great. This lady's back. Oh, and she brought friends. Joy. Wow, that ice is powerful here. Holy shit. That ice kicks ass. I'll stop you. Leaves with demons does. Someone help me. Make her have mercy. Right. Please um give me. <laughs> Bless it. Well. There's not many options I have. Okay. Here's Connor once Father more. Father wonders seeking me. Trapped within my web. All is as it should be. Why must you interfere? Why do you speak through illusions? Come, let us converse. No, it is time for you to go now. Do not persist, or things will go very badly for you. I mean, they've been doing okay for me thus far. Okay, improved drain. Wow. I got some insane damage out of that. That was like the first hit with an ice blast and it took almost all of the rage demon's health. Wow. Okay. Maybe ice was the better idea <laughs> to uh, fight with. Okay. Well, here's the demon. Very well. No more illusions. Now we meet face to face. Yes, you we do, and... and Semi-clothed to not clothed. It is here I am most powerful. And yet I have no wish to engage your power. Nor should you be so eager to engage mine. Perhaps is that a clumsy come on? We should converse instead. I've been trying to. I will not become an abomination no matter what you try. One soul I already possess. I do not need another. You need not fear me on that account. I wish only to talk. That's it? You take me for a fool. I know better than to bargain with your kind. Alas, that is sad. Is Very it really? Well then. If you wish a battle, you will have it. Let us see if your power matches your boldness, creature. Well, I mean, we've been doing good thus far. I, I mean, there's that. Another battle, I guess. Whoop. There we go. Oh, I see. Okay, well, we're doing this fucking thing again. Alright. Okay, whoa, boy. That looked like it would hurt. Probably did. You just hit once. Okay, well. Jesus. Okay, well, not going well. Okay. That ice is 
really powerful. Yep, you. Ow. Come on. And destroyed. I was trying to get to the lyrium vein. Come on. Ah. Uh. Fucking ridiculous. Couldn't even get the lyrium vein because I was fighting. So it is over. Connor is yeah. his old self. He does not seem to remember anything, which is a blessing. I suppose we will need to send him to the Circle of Magi's Tower for training once the war is over. It's so odd to think of the boy as a mage, of all things. Should Eamon yeah. recover? I'm not sure how I will tell him of all this. Isolde is dead, yet her sacrifice saved their son. There is still the matter of Jowan. He performed the ritual and did not deceive us. In a way, he saved Connor's life even though he killed his soul. I am unsure what to make of this. We will hold him for Eamon to decide his fate. If he doesn't recover, Jowan's fate is sealed. What do you think? Why do you want my opinion? It was your decision to use his ritual. You had some reason to trust him, I thought you'd have an opinion on his fate. That's fair. Would you find him useful? I would not trust him, but I would not presume to tell my brother what to do. Hmm. He was helpful. He did what was asked of him. And it was a no-win situation anyway. I would like him released. Released? This mage is a Malefica. Even if I ignore his crimes, I cannot simply unleash him on the land. He's proven he can be trusted. Perhaps you are correct. But that is Eamon's decision, not mine. I'm sorry. Jowan stays in the dungeon for now. But our task is not done yet. Whatever the demon did to my brother, it seems to have spared his life, but he remains comatose. We cannot wake him. As odd as it may seem, the quest Isolde sent the knights on may be our only hope. We must find the urn of sacred ashes. Hmm. Isn't there some other way to heal him? Like magic or something? It has been tried, and we will continue trying. Perhaps the demon's absence will make a difference. However, the relic is another option. Mm. Eamon funded the research of a Denerim scholar, a brother Genetivi. He has been trying to decipher the inscriptions on Andraste's birth rock. When Eamon fell ill, Isolde sent her knights to Genetivi in the hopes that he had finally discovered the location of Andraste's final resting place. They were unable to find him. In desperation, Isolde sent others in search of the brother or some clue of the urn's location. I do have the Dark Spawn to contend with. Eamon is well respected and powerful. He can pull Ferelden together. If you wish to fight the Dark Spawn, you will need him. That's true. That's very true. I'll see if I can find it. No one else can. Even if I wish to do it myself, I cannot abandon Redcliffe to its own devices. Perhaps you could seek out the brother's home in Denerim and see if any clues remain on his whereabouts. 
It is the only place to begin the search, I think. I must go to the uh... hall and begin rebuilding. I wish you luck, and may the Maker go with you. That's not the best decision you've saddled with and saddled me with, but I guess I don't have a choice. Nope. The waiting around part is awesome. <laughs> I'm sure it is. All right. Um. Gonna check. Did he have any injuries that haven't been healed yet? No. Well, I got spared that. Uh, Alistair and Liliana are relatively close in uh, relationship. Placement. Morrigan slightly disapproves, which is better than it was before. Okay, well, this went a ways. It could have been far worse, considering. Far, far worse. Um, oh shit, her longbow is ash. I'm going to give her a U. There we go. Far better. Um, fire bolt and ice bolt. Only works if I have crossbow, which I do not have. Um, hmm. All right. Book. And nothing else here. Looks little improved. Unless someone finds a cure soon, he will likely die a slow and painful death. I guess we gotta go get that then. Oh, there's so much to be cleaned up. I don't want to even think about what happened here. Nothing fun. Oh, hey, Connor. Mm. You're the one who saved me. Technically, it was Morgan. Then, I guess I owe her thanks. Father always said to remember to thank people who do nice things for you. I wish Mother were here. Nobody will tell me how she died. They say I'll find out when I'm older. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Feels bad, man. Feels bad. Sheesh. Allow me. I could do that for you. Question is, should we? End the episode here for now. I'll try it off camera. If it worked, I'll start up the next episode directly after that. If it doesn't work out, well, then there's that. <laughs> but, uh, anyway. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see y'all in the next episode. Shout out to SVS on YouTube for subscribing to my Patreon and supporting the channel. I very much appreciate it. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games. And very, very much uh, unsure if what I decided was the right decision. Uh, we saved Connor at the cost of his mother. Our Eamon is still lost to us without the urn. And we did a demon killing. 
So that was a thing. I'm surprised we managed to do it, considering uh, we blew through a lot of health poultices to do it. For you!